YouTube, 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 what's poppin', man? I know it's been a while, but you know that grind ain't stopping. Shout out to my notification gang. Don't forget to get that bell to ring, man. And hey, man, don't forget to like that video. Yes, yeah, sir. All right, I'm gonna take y'all today to go get this oil change. It's my first oil change on the Hellcat since I got it. We're gonna go ahead and get that co uh, cold start. This thing is also super dirty right now, so I'm also gonna get a car wash. So I'm gonna get oil change, car wash, and I gotta get my merch, man. I gotta go get some more merch. I'm gonna get a red one this time. I'm getting a red hoodie with a YouTube on it. So that's what we're gonna do today. And I'm gonna take y'all along on this ride because I don't really do too many vlogs and stuff like that. So I wanna incorporate this in there because I know y'all wanna see that Hellcat footage and I wanna know. I know y'all wanna know every single thing about a Hellcat before you get one. So I'm gonna let y'all know, man. Let's go ahead and get it, man. You know what we got on this, baby. Yes, sir. Brakes about to squeak waving. Let me see. Oh, I ain't doing it today. I think I only do it when it's cold. I'm in there. All right, I'm gonna stop by this uh t shirt mart first. That's where I get my hoodies made for the channel. Because, hey, man, that's one of the best things you can do is promote yourself. So make sure y'all get that. Don't never uh sleep on the sleep on the merch, man. You gotta have your merch. Especially if you're going, if you're going to like car shows and all of that stuff, man, you need your merch. I promise you, it's gonna play a big difference. Cause if not, they gonna think you just out there recording for your Instagram or something like that. Which is cool. That's cool. But if you're trying to uh, actually like grow and grind, and you can even get, even if you only do Instagram, if you plan on making that a uh, your little, you know, your little shebang or your little, you know, thing, you want to get you some merch, man. Sorry, this camera gonna be a little shaky, but I put it down so it won't be too shaky. But yeah, I'm gonna go get the hoodies made. Then I'm gonna try to hop in, uh, hop and get the oil changed so that way they're gonna be putting their fingerprints all on the hood and stuff like that. So I'm gonna get the oil changed first, and then I'm gonna get the car wash. And I'm probably, uh, I'm probably see what's going on tonight if there's any car meets or anything, and I'll try to include that in the video if I do any pop ups or something like that. But it is a cars and coffee tomorrow that I'm trying to hit up. But that definitely might not be in this video, just so y'all know. I'm gonna hop on this freeway. Like everything, everything is close. All of these three things that I just said I'm gonna do, they on the same exact street. I'm going to uh, T-shirt mart to get the T-shirts. Uh oh, the police on fool with them. I'm on fool with them, no kind of round, brother. Yeah, so I'm going to T-shirt mart first. And then I'm going to the uh, oil change place. I'm going to uh, either, usually I do Jiffy Lube or I do uh, Valvoline. I've been rocking with Valvoline more. I think they have, uh, it's more professional, more uh, skilled workers in there, I think. But Jiffy Lube do have the best uh, deals, but this is, not a, uh, this is not one of the cars that I used to drive, like my Buick and stuff. So I kind of got to be more careful with where I take my car because I don't want nobody messing it up. So I'm going to take this thing to Valvoline. And if they talking crazy, because you know I got to go synthetic, I'm going full synthetic. That way I can last 5,000 miles. I'm taking the trip. Oh, yeah. And for my Hellcat owners out there, Hellcat, you know, Trackhawks, all that. If you want to get in a SRT mode quick, all you got to do is tap SRT twice and it's going to take you straight to uh, track mode. Listen for the beat. You heard that beat? I'm in track mode now. I didn't have to I didn't have to click on drive modes and hurry up and click on track or sport. So people like if somebody pull up trying to race or whatever and you in eco mode and they think they didn't got down on you because you didn't forgot to switch over. No, nah, all you got to do is hit SRT twice. I can't remember his name exactly, but I know it's uh like 40, 40 from a dig or 40 to dig, something like that. He got a Hellcat ch uh, charger. I learned that from his page. I ain't gonna try to act like I learned that like on my own. I learned that from him. I'm gonna try to uh, put his uh, little thing in the video if I remember. 
remember, but we all know YouTubing is a grind, man. It, it takes a lot of time. So yeah, I'm trying to get a couple pulls before I get on the get off the freeway because uh, my exit coming up kind of quick. So I live right up the street from anything. But I find I'm finally able to get loose once I get once I get loose over here. Once I get uh, freed up. Other than that, I've been enjoying it, man. I've been daily driving it. I've been taking it to work. The sticker's definitely working. People uh, people checking out the channel. So, the stickers work. The merch work. So, it's, a cheap, it's the cheapest thing you can do to promote yourself. If not, you're going to be doing ads on Facebook. You're going to be doing ads on Instagram and stuff like that. Like, right now, I got an ad running on Instagram for two days, $20. One of my videos that I posted a while ago, and it, they, it, they just feed it out to people that's uh, like-minded and people that like the type of footage that I put out. So, it does help out a lot with uh, traffic and stuff coming to the channel. And I plan on making a, I plan on making a video on how, like, how to get to a thousand subscribers, pretty much. Like, what I did, how I, um, I boosted it up so quick because I'm not buying I ain't doing no buy I ain't buying no subscribers or nothing like that can't do that and oh yeah with Jiffy Lube if you're doing Jiffy Lube this uh, this off topic not really off topic this is uh, this the main part of the video but if you do Jiffy Lube if you go to your emails if you sign up on the email thing they send you emails every so often like every month or two to save on uh, oil changes and save on other type of maintenance and stuff so make sure you check that that's what i'm gonna check that's the first thing i'm gonna check as soon as i uh pull up i'm gonna check and see if i got any coupons anything because sometimes they have like they have like 15 20 dollars off or something like that because I, I get military discounts too but sometimes the military discount not as good as the discounts they got in the email and you can't use them, you can't use them together, so. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do as soon as I pull up. I gotta take this thing out of the track, man. This thing ride like a wagon. That's another thing I gotta put, I gotta do a review video. So they might be a good day if I can get enough sunlight. I can do that review video. And uh, as long as I got enough daylight out. But it get dark too quick, man. I need that daylight saving time to come around. YouTubers hurting out here because it get dark too quick. Police right behind me. We ain't gonna be getting no pulls right now. We ain't getting no pulls right now. I'm gonna chill out. All right, I'll turn it back on when I get to uh <laughs> to the oil change place. Ain't gonna be no pulls in this slide. Sorry guys, but uh, I need my license. You know, Kelly, and I can't let them hear the exhaust. I'm gonna turn it off. I don't want them to see. I'm gonna run off in here in this uh, t-shirt mark. T-shirt mark. That's what I was talking about. I'm running right here. They already got my template, so it shouldn't take that long. Hopefully. So y'all wish me luck. I think it's gonna be like 25, 30 bucks. So I need to start bringing my own hoodies in here. But you know, it is what it is. Yes, sir. We in there. All right. So here go the little package. Yeah, military discount and everything. So this one kind of had like a little on it. This one had a little stain on it, so guess what I got on the side of that joint. It's kind of hard doing this with one hand. How y'all do this? See the SRT? The SRT with the Hellcat on there. Yes, sir. Let them know. Got it in all red. I mean, I got the red hoodie. With the white letters. I got it a little more bold this time. Remember I was telling y'all, ain't like how last time the worst was kind of skinny. This one a lot more bold. It stand out a lot more. Going to attract a lot more attention. And I also got a white one. I got a white one. With the black letters. The different, uh, different font. Well, it's the same font. I think they just put it in bold. So y'all see that. Yes, sir. That thing clean. It's actually for the wife right here. So she said she going to rock this one. She wanted a white one. So I got it a white one. That was a. Uh, it was sixty bucks, y'all. So it was only sixty bucks. I mean, you gotta invest in yourself. So 
I mean, I'm planning on getting my parents one. I tried to call my uh, dad while he was in the, while I was in there to get his size, but he didn't answer the phone, so. Next time, next time. And I also got this for my road trip, y'all. Got that bra. Bugs, they ain't about to eat my paint up. Easy on, easy off. This thing kind of expensive for what it is. It was about $120, $130. But I mean, the front bumper paint gonna be way more than that. So I'd rather protect it now. Plus if I end up going on a road trip back home to Arkansas or if I go to Texas to meet up with some of my guys down there, I already know them uh, mosquitoes gonna be eating. So that bra gonna help a lot. So that's gonna be my little bumper guard for now. I'm about to go run by, uh, what's that, Valvoline? Valvoline, whatever it's called get this oil changed hopefully i got a, a coupon in my uh, email if not damn it is what it is i use the military discount cool we out so to keep y'all in the loop want the valvoline i called two of them i went to one and i called the other one and neither one of them had a zero w40 because that's what the hell cash used i just called jiffy lube Jiffy Lou said they got it, but he answered kind of quick, so I'm gonna see if he actually got it. I don't know. Hopefully they got it. It's right, like it's right, like one block up. So I'm not too worried if I make the drive over there and they don't have it. So I ain't gonna be too mad. But he answered kind of quick, so I'm not sure. So we gonna see. We gonna see. Keep y'all in the loop. I knew it was too good to be true. So as far as the oil change. All right, all right, y'all. I knew it. I knew it. I knew he wasn't going to be able to uh, get the oil changed today. So what happened, uh, I went in there, I pulled up, and they was like, yeah, we got the oil, but we ain't got the filter. So I guess Hellcats use a, a specific filter. So I got to do my research, y'all. But I guess uh, I, went to the, I went to the Dodge. I went to Dodge and tried to get an oil filter from them. But the parts department closed as soon as I pretty much walked in. I was like, man, come on. So I'm gonna have to wait till either Monday or if I can find some somewhere else, I'll call around, see what I can find. But I'm trying to get this oil. I gotta get this oil changed by Monday. If I can't get it changed by Monday, then it's over with. Then I'm gonna have to either drive there with no oil change. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll be good. As long as I, I'll check the oil, make sure it look clean. As long as it look clean, we good. As long as it's full. But if not, then I wasn't trying to go down there, go down there without no oil change. So I'm trying to get this oil change before I go down there. Change, it's gonna change climates. The climate gonna change, it's gonna be cold. And I ain't wanna, I ain't wanna do that to the car. I don't wanna strain the car like that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this filter. If I don't get no filter, then we we'll have, we'll have to duke it out. Check the oil, make sure it's good. But yeah, this this gonna be the end of this video, man. I'll keep y'all updated on what happened if I do another video on it, or I might keep this video going until I get the oil changed, actually. But it is what it is. I let y'all appreciate y'all stopping by, man. If you're first time viewing, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and share the video, man. If you enjoyed the video. We out, man. Peace.